Some say that sports brings out the best in people. Many thousands of people go to games to see their favorite athletes perform against what they deem as adversity. Fans try to cheer their teams to victory. Who will fold? Who will prevail? Regardless of who wins and loses, or how loud the fans cheer, it's important for each athlete to prepare well beforehand in order to achieve excellence. Success is never maximized without hard work. Many use a Malcolm Gladwell book to say that 10,000 hours of practice at something makes you a world-class phenom at it. Yet, that's slightly misused. In actuality, Gladwell studied many ultra-successful people in their trades, and the common denominator was that they put countless hours into honing their skills, regardless of whether they were on a big stage or not. Just as sports requires its athletes to prepare well before a game, we need to be disciplined and work hard in preparation of what the Lord has given us to do. If you're a Christian and yet never take time to study the Bible, how can you expect to give a good answer to those who want to know what it says? An approved workman is not ashamed. So work hard. Whatever it is, work so hard at it. Work even when it doesn't make sense to you. But what about when you mess up? Practice never makes perfect. We're human. But when we mess up, we need to show good character. We don't need to storm around hurting ourselves, making a fool of ourselves, raging about showing a lack of self-control, or even ruining things that are important for our future. Instead, we need to honor God by our actions. Many times when we flop, we need to go back to the drawing board and work hard again. Ecclesiastes 9 verse 10 says, Whatever your hand finds to do, do it with all your might. My prayer for you is that you can enjoy blessing from the hard work you put in, and that you have real focus in developing what God has given you. And you know what? That clip was also not supposed to go that way, so maybe I need to do some more work. But bottom line, work hard regardless of who's watching you or who isn't watching you, and do everything as unto the Lord and not unto men with all your might. And God bless you.